UR in Malaysia is basically defined when we put external energy inside the reservoir and this uh, external energy or injectant that we introduce change the physiochemical properties of the fluid such as density, interfacial tension, viscosity and so on. EOR in Malaysia basically started back in 1980s. We started with research in small scales and then progressively advanced ourselves to what we are right now. and our vision to become a leading EOR player in the world by 2030. In Malaysia, Petronas is leading about 12 EOR projects. Globally, Petronas also involved in about 3 to 6 projects EOR worldwide. Due to higher viscosity and density of the fluids in our international asset, we use thermal EOR to recover more oil. Depending on the reservoir and fluid characterizations of these fields, we adopt the best suitable EOR techniques. All the techniques that involve in EOR, the chemical floodings, the gas techniques and also the thermal techniques was used to increase our reserve and to bring values to Petronas. For example, in offshore Trenggano, Malaysia, Angsi fields, we are implementing chemical UR flood to recover additional 60 million barrel of oil. Using these techniques, especially in our international operations in Sudan and Venezuela, we are expecting to recover about 10 to 15 percent additional oil to our reserve book. To ensure our UR projects are more cost-effective, we continuously invest on research and development to improve our current technology. For example, Petronas has successfully invented our own super surfactant and polymer for our chemical UR projects. This new chemical developed by Petronas works in a very challenging environment for example, in high salinity injected water and also in high temperature. To extend production life cycles of our asset, Petronas believe that UR will be the next technology frontier.